Who told Donald Trump about the tape? Who watched it with him? What was his reaction? Oh, we were in debate prep, and one of the members of the team came in and took some of us, a few of us out, and showed us. We didn't have the tape for a long time. We only had a transcript. And so, but anyway, you know the rest. Donald Trump decided he would like to put out a video apology, and he did that night. And two days later was the, less than two days later, was the second debate in St. Louis. And he carried forward with that. I will tell you, if you look at the polling, that incident affected Donald Trump's numbers much more significantly than the Comey letter affected Hillary Clinton's numbers. That's just a fact. You can go back and look at the, at the data. And there was not early voting really underway on October 7th as opposed to what had already been banked by October 28th. A lot of folks had voted already by the time the Comey letter came out, three weeks well, to the day. Probably 80 to 90 percent of the electorate had not yet voted when the Comey but, letter when came out. When the tape came fairness. out, uh, Saturday Night Live had Hillary Clinton popping a bottle of champagne. Yeah, that was ridiculous. Was, was, but was that your reaction? Did you think, oh my god, this is done, this is over? Not at all. That was not, in fact, I remember the, the meeting I was in when that news came out was we were dealing with WikiLeaks. And uh, that was something that our campaign, the, the stolen emails that the Russians were leaking out, we had to deal with that every day, and we stayed focused on that. I thought people, anybody who was popping champagne bottles was uh, uh, just wrong. Uh, and in fact, again, I remember putting, we put out a video two weeks out from election day saying we can lose this race and we got to rally and we got to work hard.